Hello, and welcome to my presentation reel about my work as a professional speaker, business trainer, and motivator. In this reel, I've included PowerPoint slides that I've used in a variety of work to teach people. They're put together in topics to help give you an idea of the type of work to do. And of course, I've included a few testimonials and some of the types of companies that I work for. So everything I teach, I've learned first for myself. I found it important, and so then I teach others. I'm skimming through these slides, so stop and start the video if you wish to read what I've included on the slides. Now, I have been out of this speaking and training business for a while, but I've been working on a motivational educational product in a fun, feel, good movie and television series. It's been a huge project where I've written it and worked back in the tertiary education and had other work so that I could actually do the writing. Finally, the writing is finished and it's ready for a producer. It is a new product combining products that we actually already use into a new format. So on the phone apps are topics that I've taught into my previous work and I'm going to continue teaching again because they're important to people development. While I've been writing, I've engaged in a huge amount of business and personal development for myself, which now I'm ready to teach others. Now, I use this logo to demonstrate we're always at a new place every second and every now moment, we have the opportunity to create a better decision, a new decision to upgrade our skills and make a positive choice in our life or not. I teach people to create an improved positive future and success for themselves by embracing um, success with a positive attitude and so that people are actually ready to learn. Where I can, I include a brief about our brain because this here feeds our information so that we can create a better life for ourselves, make better choices. I explain about the left and right brain and how we use it and its importance in the workforce. Now, this was a huge aha moment for me. It was helping me to understand why I like colour and mind mapped and vision boards instead of linear black and blue um, goals set in a, in a line. Everyone's thoughts create their future and it's helping them to understand their individuality from their fingerprints, their heartbeats, their eye scan, soul and intuition, and all of these influence their decision making. So it's embracing that, plus aligning it to the work, enabling them to perform the best for themselves and as an employee. So my first business was children's clothing, and my second business was training, and I called myself in the business the Attitude Specialist. And of course, the movie I've written is called The Attitude Specialist as well. So you can tell that it's important to me. Um, it's about embracing a new way to move forward. So these are some of the things that I talk about and along with the movie are seven books with one of them called The Living Art of Positivity, which of course this is included. Something I've learned throughout my life and these slides reflect something else that's also going to be including in, in the uh, movie. And of course, also in the books. So retraining our brain, it's the positive outcome that we choose if we want to upgrade and upskill ourselves and our lives. These slides, how we think in life, show how we think in life and why it's imperative to upgrade our thinking if we want self-improvement for ourselves through the constant change of mindset. The power of one is when a team works together. And although this is not my speciality, I have included it in presentations, but I do have access to other material if it is required. Understanding our personality was another huge aha for me. I've had the most positive feedback from all my workshops about this topic. One company ringing me and say how they heard their staff comment about a friend who is now a leader. She's just wearing her eagle or team leader hat. And another school principal comment was, why didn't they teach this to us in teacher training? It makes so much sense. And yes, it does. So it's from understanding oneself, how we interact with people. It's also useful to understand its concept in business, even useful to understand communication styles, both verbal and written and much more. Now, I'm passionate about dealing with people in difficult 
difficult people in difficult situations and bullying. Early in my business, I toured New Zealand for seven years with these public workshops, and it resulted in in-house training. I've experienced it for myself several times and will have a book coming out on this topic with the movie as well. So depending on the solutions needed in the training depends on whether these vital empowering people and personal development concepts are mentioned, but they are actually also important in business. So another huge aha for me was learning about transactional analysis, which is why there's a quiz included in the, in the movie. It's differentiation between lose-lose and working its way up to win-win style relationships and the skill set and the knowledge and the new tools that we have to have to be able to create that. And all this growth comes from communication and styles so that we can create more positive boundaries for ourselves and have the confidence to do it. And we can do it with words. It's how we speak, how we listen, how we comprehend, and actually to be able to have the confidence to be able to do it as well. So to create change, we need to have improved results. And here is two concepts I have taught. So where appropriate, I include this nanosecond phenomenon that was within all of us. It's about our feelings and it's vital to our growth and it is included in topics like stress and how to create better outcomes. I'm passionate about self-esteem. It's been my journey. Um, I had high school bullying, so, you know, it has been a journey to, to go up the scale um, so that I now could present easy peasy to any global company that wants to, um, to take on and, and produce the movie. But it's been a journey to be able to do that. So self-esteem is one of Google's top search engine terms, and it's the movie's underlying message. So in this interview here, we were on the same page. We just had a few different words. So I believe that everyone has the possibility of better outcomes by providing information they have um, right now and understanding it and the opportunity to who they could become. I've done that for myself and maybe you've done that for yourself as well. So some of these resources that I'm mentioning here, I am turning into phone app and quizzes, um, but as people are boostful, uh, uh, boosted to succeed. It's helpful for them to understand their re reasons and solutions and some of the things that they can do. So the mindset, past, present and future, yes, it's about choosing to learn, thus creating a, a better outcome for ourselves. So it's, it's also understanding the influences that we have and the decision-making processes that are available to us. So these slides here I've used in stress-related presentations or we want to where we want to increase um, our, our happiness, our success rate in life. And it's it's assessing where we are um, because it's in the outcomes and are we getting what I want. So, you know, as we are constantly upgrading ourselves, because change is constant, um, it's examining our mindset and what can we do so that we can handle this change for ourselves and in our workplace performance. So changing up is deciding that we have the, the control over ourselves to be successful, happy, and create a, a holistic, rewarding, balanced life we want, and or following our own destiny or not. It's completely up to every person. So in this presentation on creativity, I included the use of intuition in our brain and the universe as they are similar complex, and it's about sourcing um, new eye, cutting edge ideas to advance society by providing new products. You know, it's having that idea in the shower in the morning or walking along the beach or while you're doing the dishes. Where did that come from? So two entrepreneurs here in New Zealand who've had those ideas for sailing and filming have introduced concepts which are still actually um, being, we are still being rewarded in the economy of New Zealand. So in this presentation, I also included about military scientific inventions and other global giants who use this concept. Even Jack Canfield, who sold 5 million books on the topic of chicken, about chicken soup for the soul. And of course, the late, great Steve Jobs with his creativity and new products. And as society to continues to evolve with more ideas, I love his bottom right quote, those who think that they can change the world the one that usually do, because actually that's me. I, I'm, I've got one of those with the movie as I stepped into the unknown. It was too great an idea um, not to develop and the huge impact that it can have globally, first to the audience, 
Um, but then economically as a business is is massive as well. Um, so thank you, Steve, for that quote. It keeps me motivated many, many times. So in conclusion, I teach, I teach learning and accelerated learning styles. Um, and you know, even with technology and, and AI, people still have to interact with each other. I mean, AI can't. Um, write our immediate answers. Uh, we actually have to use our brain. So it's up to judge and juggle new technology, what we're going to use and use it to our advantage and keep our brains and ourselves tuned into ourselves. And for that, we need knowledge skills. And yes, we gain wisdom as we learn. So my final slides are two Another two global giants who influenced my thinking. Oprah, a self-made billionaire who won the Horatio Alger Awards for overcoming adversity and teaching these seven topics, which just happen to be the same topics that I adhere to in my teaching. So I haven't got any rewards for it yet, but you never know what's going to come. And then, of course, the late, great Nelson Mandela and a world leader and this quote that he made famous. It also changed my life and I endeavoured to teach others to step up um, via my work, I can teach them my upcoming movie and books and, and provide new op opportunities and avenues um, for them, but also new avenues that will open up so that I can continue teaching people to step up into their greatness. So I hope you've enjoyed my presentation reel. Um, it's the first one I've ever done. Uh, dare I say that intuition prompted me to do it. But please contact me if you're interested um, in helping me helping your audience. On my e website, you'll find my Introducing Janice um, new video that I, that I did. And um, there's also a free report, which I'm just updating as well, about absenteeism and wellness in the um, workforce. So thank you very much for your time.